So within that, I've mentioned sort of technology advancements. How has the advancements in t technology, particularly in AI and machine learning, transformed HR analytics for companies? Well, it's, as I said, like back in the day, we were really thinking about kind of taking theoretical frameworks, right, and, and applying it to, you know, a business situation, right? A theoretical framework being like how you calculate a return on investment, for example, right? Mm -hmm. and, and, and using, let's say, traditional models for, for, for tackling those types of questions. What big data does for you generally in all domains as well as HR is that the whole kind of theoretical basis for what you're doing kind of disappears or becomes less important. And really what you are doing is trying to gather enough data that you can use that data to make some kind of prediction. And it, it doesn't really matter that you understand why it works. You only really care that it does work. So what that means in the HR space is that we don't necessarily create these kind of really elaborate taxonomy of skills and then from a theoretical basis try to figure out you know if someone has certain skills what are the next skill they might need to progress in some theoretical career we just kind of mm -hmm. read in the data and we we make a prediction based on that data so when you go onto amazon it said you know you're interested in these two things you might be interested in this also right that, Amazon doesn't know why you're interested in that other thing. It just knows you're interested in the last two things. And people who are interested in that might also be interested in this. But there's no like kind of scientific reason behind it, right? There's no thought. It's just kind of a pattern. And this kind of approach is now kind of used in, in HR, right? Where we say, okay, people like you do these learnings. People like you who've done these learnings also like these learnings, for example. Yeah. Or you know, we've noticed that people with this profile do well in this job, you know, and, and there's no real explanation for it, right, necessarily. It's just a pattern. And, and that's really changes the way you, you do analytics and approach the world. But what it also means is you can then have these kind of tailored, tailored recommendations or tailored products towards a particular employee. So the kind of analytics you might have done before that were really for managers, and so managers can make decisions about the workforce, these type of recommendations can now be done en masse at the individual level and given directly to the individual or the employee as a recommendation. Here's a learning for you. Here's a job you should think about, you know, et, et cetera. Yeah. Yeah, and no, I think also definitely it's going to get I guess that's what AI does. It gives you that personalization, and this is obviously giving that personalized. That this could be the right path for you. Gives you options. Gives you, I guess, you a bit of guidance and advice how other people have progressed as well. 